after 50 our next question is uh, 24th question so this one is we are going to define a bill of factors based on the phasor representation phasor representation already we have done uh, in previous question uh, 23rd question so this is a phasor representation by using this phasor representation we are going to define a phase difference what is meaning of phase difference and in phase and the lagging and the leading you remember from this out of four you will get one uh, short answer in your external exam so what is the phase difference what is the in phase and what is the lagging and what is the leading simply definition and waveform and a phasor diagram okay so you remember phase difference means when two alternating quantities of the same frequency have a different zero points they are said to have a phase difference so it's mean you remember here we are going to take this one is a omega t and this is a amplitude only here so that amplitude is either a voltage amplitude or otherwise current amplitude so the phase difference in the sense what is the difference between this voltage source uh, starting point and the current source starting point between what is that angle okay that one only a phase difference it means where that voltage started so it differs the current in a different uh, point different point okay it means suppose for example the voltage source started from zero point and it differs a little bit angle after that it means exactly we are taking in the sense here 90 degrees of this uh, voltage source okay so at 90 degrees only started current value okay at zero angle voltage source started but current started at 90 degrees of the voltage source okay so that difference angle only we are going to take a phase difference okay then we will go for in phase in phase in the sense these in this type of in phase will arrive in a uh, purely resistive load condition what is meaning of uh, in phase in a sense two waveforms are said to be in phase when the phase difference between them is zero it means there is no any phase difference between voltage source and the current source both voltage source and current source start at zero point only okay that is the zero point of both waveforms are same it's mean so you remember here voltage source also started from uh, zero point and current source also current source also started from zero point at uh, 90 degrees both the current and voltage is getting a peak value okay so that to phasor diagram we are rep representing in, in phase only this one in the same line only we are taking both current value and voltage value this is the phasor diagram and uh, formulas are v is equal to vm sin omega t i equal to im sin omega t that's it